You know who I watched tonight? I'll be honest with you. I watched the Cleveland Cavaliers play the Hornets. And uh, for the first time ever, I saw them kind of without LeBron, right, play. And I actually thought uh, tonight they looked pretty good. I've heard all this I can take about Colin Sexton, that they don't like him. Uh, I still have to figure out why that is. Why is it because he's so cocky or because he shoots so much? Or, I mean, it, it's pretty apparent to me he's their point guard. They let him bring the ball up. So he's the man with the rock, and he plays like the whole game, Mafia. I don't know if you knew that or not. Kid uh, Nawaba went to the hole a lot. Very small shooting guard, but the guy has a motor on him and legs. The guy can jump. And he had 18 points. He was 7 of 9 from the floor and had 5 rebounds, 2 dimes, and a steal. I thought Nawaba played his ass off. Clarkson scored at will. Hood scored at will. JR at 13. Sexton 16. Uh, Tristan Thompson had 21 Pharrell and rebounds. That's how you win in the NBA. You get a guy to have 21 rebounds and 11 points. The guy worked his ass off on the glass. So I'm telling you, there was nobody there. No one was at the game. Uh, Cleveland's dead without LeBron James. The franchise is like on you know death row. But I got to tell you, tonight, even though they're miserable and they're 2-11, and 11, they won the game. That was their second win. That's how bad they are. But they kicked Charlotte's ass, 113-89. I actually took the Cavs on the spread side and covered. I thought they would show up tonight because they've been so bad. They're desperate to play well. And I really didn't think they looked that bad. I mean, seriously, with the team that I saw on the floor, I mean, I don't think they're good or anything. But I'll be honest with you. Nance, Thompson, Sexton, Hood, Nawaba, and Clarkson, to me... To me, they looked happy. They didn't have pressure on them. They didn't have to live up to anybody's expectations where it's all about LeBron and nobody else, right? Because that was happening there for sure. That was definitely happening there. Where it, and, and rightfully so, right? I mean, it should have been all LeBron all day, every day. But I actually thought, um, you know, Clarkson and Hood were doing whatever they wanted. They had a green light. They scored a lot. I thought they moved the ball a lot. I thought Thompson was crashing the glass like no other. I mean, I watched the first half and he was dominating the boards and getting buckets the first time i seen him without lebron i thought they looked happy i didn't think they looked miserable i thought the crowd was miserable and it looks like no one wants to go see uh, the Cavs anymore in cleveland like that's the cheapest ticket in town now and that's what happens when lebron james leaves you at the altar twice